she's getting the parlor ready for all the cows and there they are at the end, can you see them? They're all waiting to be let in and they will all, as far as I know, they will all know where to go. And it's all worked out. Here they come. I'm moving over. Here they come. Turn back a bit because I don't want to put them off. I'm sure they're not used to anybody filming them. You see, they all know to come in right to the end. Lauren is, Lauren is at university doing agriculture and she tells me that she's, uh, when she finishes, she's going to go into poultry farming. This is John now, the farmer. So it's all automated. They uh, are given so much food. I'm not quite sure what John's doing. John, what are you doing? You what? Uh, disinfecting? Yes. Right. John is spraying the others with the disinfectant so that everything is pristine clean. And Lauren is coming along as well with the cloth. And an extra cleaning. Wonder. Now, just before, um, just before uh, she puts on these teeth, John was telling me, uh, what did she do first, John? Well, first of all, she as you saw, we spray with a, a, a pre-milking disinfectant, with a, and it, it is also a teeth conditioner. And she um, does a dry wipe with the paper towel to get any dust or dirt off. Then she strips each quarter or each feet a couple of times to stimulate the cow to release the milk letdown hormone which is called oxytocin which released from the security gland and that means that when Lauren attaches the unit the cow is already um, right to release the milk straight away yes. plus it also um, removes the highest bacteria of milk. The first few strands of milk in a cow's teeth would contain a higher level of bacteria. And uh, it, removing them, plus it also tests for the status of a cow has an infection in the quarter. If it's um, clinical mastitis, then there will be um, lumps or clots showing in the milk. Yeah. Well, that's great um, to know all that. Uh, I'm not of farming stock, although my grandfather had cows and a milk business, and I used to go out with them to deliver the milk when I was young. And uh, there are 14 cows here being milked all together on one side, and then on the other side, and there's the one in the end, all waiting. Very patient. And the food is. Um, worked out by computer and it is uh, worked on the basis of seven day yield and put, uh, so it's an average and then it is automatically fed into the uh, troughs in the front of the cars. That looks as if that one's finished.